neighborhood infrastructure bond projects have started. And once roadways are resurfaced, the focus will be on pedestrian and bike safety. Our existing bike lane network is ever changing and ever evolving. And part of that, that um, what we want to do is really expand on best practices across the country and some of that inv involves some things that people maybe are not used to seeing. That includes green paint bike lanes. Currently we have green painted lanes along Cleveland Street and at the intersection of Stone and Main. The green paint is meant to call attention to the bike lane. And so in addition to those, uh, the green paint, you're going to start seeing some things that are called bike boxes. And so as you're approaching an intersection, typically a signalized intersection, you're going to start seeing spaces that's devoted for cyclists to actually get in front of traffic to give them the right of way so that if they need to make a left or right turn, uh, the vehicle knows that they're there and they have a clear path to do so. The city will also add high visibility crosswalks for pedestrians and narrow travel lanes. Narrowing the lanes on our roads can actually slow traffic and is a traffic calming measure. So head on over to greenvillesc.gov slash nib for more on the neighborhood infrastructure bond. I'm Lauren Thomas for the city of Greenville.